Time for a change. This is our family's history in this little short video. We start off with the oil lamps and the books. We move on to telephones. And these are the different telephones. Got a hands-free ones and mobile ones and we move on to smartphones and I'm taking this with an iPhone which should be sat just there but I have to use it to do this video and we have floppy disk and we move on to zip disk and CDs and pen drives there's my old hard disk which is 20 meg <laughs> there's my old laptop Somewhere. That one's 20 meg. Not your Hemistos, and all the programs were loaded from floppy disks. Then we move on to there's a modem. Everything used to come through the telephone wire in those days. And onto my new laptop and the hair very behind it. So we start with the snail and we finish with the hair. This is a fibre optic which now delivers data. One of those little tiny fibres, you can see it blowing in the wind. You can shift gigabytes. Gigabyte after gigabyte. So it's gigabit capacity, that fibre, as opposed to a few bytes through that. A very few. And this is another sort of fibre that we might be experimenting with. So it's sort of plug and play fibre. I haven't had a go with that yet. And all the gadgets that clip it all together. And this is the ducting that you blow fibre through, so you put that in the ground. It's only tiny. There's my fingers in the way. You can see how small it is compared to a pound coin. That's a blue pound coin. The idea of the blue pound coin is you say, see how long that stays in your community when you spend it. So you spend it at the shop and the lady in the shop gives it in change to somebody who passes it on to school with the dinner money and the school goes and buys something with it and somebody else goes to church and puts it in the collection and the vicar takes it and pays some of his bills with it. And it stays in the community and when we build our network we'll be running our network ourselves so all the money we pay for our services will stay in our community and we'll all be working for the network we'll build it we'll look after it we'll mend it if it gets broken we'll help people get online and stay online a bit community network that will go for miles to all the remote farms on those hillsides thank you for watching just farmers doing it <laughs>